Hello friends, welcome back to our channel Footech 360 and you are watching Footech quiz number 75 topic national bodies in India. It consists of 20 MCQs. So watch the video till end and comment down your score out of 20. Without any further delay, let's get started. Question number 1. APIDA stands for Options A. Agricultural and Processed Food Products Export Development Authority B. Agricultural and Perishable Food Products Export Development Authority C. Agricultural and Processed Food Products Environment Development Authority D. None of these Correct answer A. Agricultural and Processed Food Products Export Development Authority Question number 2 APIDA Act passed by the Parliament in Dash Options A. 1984 B. 1985 C. 1986 D. 1990 Correct answer B. 1985 Question number 3 APIDA Act came into effect from Options A. 5th August 2011 B. 13th February 1986 C. 20th December 1957 D. 12th December 1986 Correct answer B. 13th February 1986 Question number 4 Chairman of APIDA will be appointed by Options A. Central Government B. State Government C. Codex Elementaris Commission D. None of these Correct answer A. Central Government Question number 5 Head Office of APIDA is located at Options A. Kolkata B. Mumbai C. New Delhi D. Chennai Correct answer C. New Delhi Question number 6 BIA stands for Options A. Bureau of International Standards B. Bureau of Indian Standards C. Basics of Indian Standards D. None of these Correct answer B. Bureau of Indian Standards Question number 7. BAS was established on 23rd December dash. Options A. 2006 B. 1986 C. 2017 D. 2011 Correct answer B. 1986 Question number 8. Headquarters of BAS is located at Options A. Kolkata B. Mumbai C. New Delhi D. Chennai Correct answer C. New Delhi Question number 9 How many regional offices are there for BIS? Options A. 20 B. 10 C. 8 D. 5 Correct answer D. 5 Question number 10 BIS comes under which department? Options A. Department of Marketing and Inspection B. Department of Agriculture and Corporation C. Department of Consumer Affairs D. None of these Correct answer C. Department of Consumer Affairs Question number 11 EIC stands for Options A. Export Inspection Corporation B. Export Inspection Council C. Export Indian Council D. None of these Correct answer B. Export Inspection Council Question number 12 EIC is responsible to ensure Options A. Quality and safety of products imported to India B. Quality and safety of products exported from India C. Licensing of food products D. None of these Correct answer B. Quality and safety of products exported from India Question number 13 EIC was set up by the Government of India under which section of the Export Quality Control and Inspection Act 1963? Options A. Section 2 B. Section 3 C. Section 4 D. Section 22 Correct answer B. Section 3 Question number 14 EIC provides certifications for which of the following? 
options a dairy products b meat and meat products c egg products d all of the above correct answer d all of the above question number 15 mpeda stands for options a meat products export development authority b marine products export development authority c marine products export development agency d none of these correct answer b marine products export development authority question number 16 which of these following are major functions of mpeda options a registration of infrastructural facilities for seafood export trade b promotion of indian marine products in overseas markets c market promotional activities and publicity of marine products d all of these correct answer d all of these question number 17 headquarters of mpeda is located at options a new delhi b kochi c chennai d kolkata correct answer b kochi question number 18 which is the major product exported by mpeda options a frozen cuttlefish b frozen shrimp c frozen squid d dried squid correct answer b frozen shrimp question number 19 spice board of india was established on 26th february dash options a 1960 b 1968 c 1987 d 1990 correct answer c 1987 question number 20 which among the following are the main functions of spice board options a post harvest improvement of all spices b development of spices in the northeast c research development and regulation of domestic marketing of small and large cardamom d all of these correct answer d all of these Now come and down your score out of 20. If you have missed out the previous videos, we have linked them down in the description. For instant updates, you can join us on our Telegram channel, Facebook and Instagram. Link is in the description. If you want all the topic wise important MCQs in PDF format, kindly join as premium member. For more details, kindly check the description box and comment section or directly contact through our official mail ID futech360info@gmail.com. So that's all for this video don't forget to subscribe to our channel Fudek360 thank you